In this problem, we have to find v of t, which is the velocity, r of t, which is the position, and evaluate r at t equals 9. Here, a is the acceleration, and it's given in the problem, along with these two conditions. So, solution. So, the first thing we'll do is we'll find v of t. So, whenever you have the acceleration, and you integrate it, you'll get the velocity. That's because the derivative of velocity is acceleration. So integrating the acceleration, we're going to get v of t. And we just integrate each piece. So 8i hat will become 8t i hat. And 6k hat will become 6t k hat. Plus and we always add an arbitrary vector, which we'll call capital C. Okay, so now we're going to use our first condition here, v of zero equals 4j. So v of zero is equal to eight times zero i hat plus six times zero k hat plus c. And that's equal to 4j. So just plugging in 0 for all of the t's here, and we set it equal to, to 4j. So all of this goes away. It's all 0. So you just get c equals 4j. So now we're going to take this and plug it back into v. So v of t is equal to 8ti hat plus 6 t k hat plus 4 j hat. I'm going to rewrite this in a nicer order. So it's really 8 t i hat plus 4 j hat plus 6 t k hat. Just to write it in the i j k forms. That, that's the first answer. I'm just going to go ahead and box it in. And now we have to find uh, the position. So to find position, we just integrate velocity. So we get r of t. Whoops, forgot my arrows. I tend to forget the arrows. You know, it's not too big of a deal. So integrating 8t, it's going to give us 8t squared over 2 using the power rule, i hat, plus 4t j hat, plus 6t squared over 2 k hat. All right, so this is, oh, plus our capital C. And we know that r of 0 is equal to 0. Okay, so this is r of t. Let me clean it up. So this is going to be 4t squared i hat uh, plus 4t j hat plus 3t squared k hat plus our capital C. Last thing to do is plug in 0. So when you plug in 0, you're going to get 0 i hat plus 0 j hat plus 0 k hat plus c equals 0. So c is equal to the 0 vector. You just get c equals 0. So nothing changes. So your answer for r of t is actually just, I'll write it over here again, maybe in a different color. So it'll be r of t equals 4t squared i hat plus 4t j hat plus 3t squared k hat plus 0, so you don't bother to write it. So that would be r of t. And the last thing is to find r of 9 in this problem. So let's go ahead and do that. So r of 9, and I have a calculator here with me, so I'm just going to grab it. So we have 4 times 9 squared i hat plus 4 times 9. Well, I can do that one in my head. <laughs> plus uh, 3 times 9 squared k hat. The first one was intimidating. 4 times 9 squared, hmm, I could probably, you know, it's 4 times 81, so it's not too bad. Um, let's see, but let's not let's not be heroes here. So four times eighty-one, I got three hundred and twenty-four. Wow, wow, big numbers. I hat plus four times nine, which is thirty-six. 
j hat. And the last one is 3 times 81, because 9 squared is 81. So that's 243, 243 uh, k hat. So this would be the position vector at t equals, say, 9 seconds. I hope this video has been helpful in some way. Good luck and take care.